Before we can create a resource group and submit the template into it, we need to log into Azure. Um, good news is once you've logged into Azure, then you'll be logged in for about a week. Um, if you do control and single quote or go through view and then integrate to terminal, um, then this is what will pop up. This is the bash version. You may well have set up the PowerShell version, um, but I'm going to type in AZ login. I've already logged myself out to go through this process again. Now this should automatically open up a window with all the code. So this is a bit slicker than it used to be. Um, and then you go through the credential process, which for me is going to be as much as clicking on that. And then it will authenticate you using multi-factor authentication if need be and get you logged in. Now, if like me, you have multiple subscriptions, then you can do AZ account list. And I'm going to do that in the table format rather than the color JSON you see there. And then that will list out my multiple subscriptions. I'm going to pick this one here, take that code. And then if I do az account set minus subscription and then paste in that subscription GUID, then that should show the right one. You can always show at any point which one you're in, your context. If you do az account show, and that'll show you which subscription you're in, and also uh, whether or not you're a person or if you're a managed service identity or if you are logging in using the service principle. But uh, for most of you, you should be a normal user.